I'm Jessica from the Medium team. Jessica, what are you showing here at Oculus Connect? I'm showing Medium, which is a sculpting app on the Rift using the touch controllers, where you, using the touch controllers, you basically sculpt in VR. So talk about what it was like working with Oculus and the touch controls to make this tool a reality. Oculus has been really, really great. Uh, they're very supportive and gracious. Everyone there is super smart, and they have a real passion for content creation. The touch controllers have been really perfect for this application because it really allows you to get into finer detail. It's a precision tool, just like sculpting. It's a really tactile experience. So what do you feel this will open up for artists and game modelers and stuff in the future of VR and gaming? I think the possibilities with something like this and with all the other content creation tools coming out with VR tools is the possibilities are endless. There's so many different things you can do and you're not limited by space or by time. And you have all of the functionality and accessibility at your fingertips. It could be for someone who's just a total beginner or an aspiring creative or someone who's even using it for professional means. There's just so much range and versatility. Now once you're done making something in Medium, can you export it to Maya or 3D Max and mess with it more? Yeah, so there's actually a functionality where you can export it into a high-res OBJ and then you can export it exactly into 3ds Max, Maya, MeshLab, Mudbox, a whole host of things. We actually have um, 3D printed sculpts made in Medium in the concourse area um, that have been painted and sometimes printed in full color. Um, you can also, uh, we've seen people rig the stuff that they've made in Medium to be animated and it's been really cool to see how people have been taking this and, and kind of like expanding the reach of what we even thought was possible. So how far do you think we are from actual gloves you can put on to actually shape clay using your fingers rather than the Oculus Touch? That would be really cool. That kind of feedback, like kind of touch feedback, more than the touch controllers, would be incredible. I have no idea, really. How will this work with programs like ZBrush? I hope we're getting there. I'm not really quite sure. I mean, what's cool about Medium is that um, it takes the curve of learning 3D modeling and it kind of um, kind of breaks away that obstacle so you can get started and get your feet wet and get really like interested and inspired. And so I think that's really Medium strength, the, the idea of, to make you feel empowered and engaged and make you feel challenged and like the the, explore the possibilities of like what 3D modeling is and what like art creation is. You talk about how you guys worked with actual professional artists when developing the, uh, I want to call it an application almost. Yeah, kind of like an application or experience, but it's really powerful, right? Um, it's not like quite a game, but it's definitely really playful and fun. Um, I think we, we have a lot of artist friends. Um, Medium was made by a lot of engineers turned artists. And so we have a lot of artist friends who kind of like comment on all the functionality and help us prioritize what to do. Um, and then they, they give it a try and they make incredible things. We actually had, um, did you go to last night's party? No. So last night uh, we had six of our artist friends live sculpting at the party. We gave them themes like cryptozoologist dream mm -hmm. and they would just live sculpt for 30 minutes the things that they make and it was incredible. They made like octopuses with, um, with like heart eyes and heart pucker like sucker things and it was really cool. The stuff that they can make is amazing. So when does your software come out? What platforms will it be on? And will it ever, will it ever be on the HTC Vive? Um, we're primarily a, an Oculus title, uh, seeing as we're a team with an Oculus, right. and we ship with Touch. We're free with Touch. December 6, 2016. Yes, yes.